Hi everybody, William Huffman here. Um, I'm driving and just gonna make a video, plus I'm more of a talker than I am a typer. Um, some of you are asking about how I'm doing Facebook, um, and it's not in traditional how a lot of other people are doing it. So I'll just break it down for you really quickly here. Um, probably five minutes or who knows. So I use a platform called Conversion. Um, there's tons of systems out there that do what I'm about to say, but the one that I happen to use is Conversion. Um, uh, step one, be on Facebook. Step two, join every single for sale site that you can within 100 miles or whatever. I'm in Minnesota, I'm in over 800 garage sale sites or for sale sites. Step three, have a system that allows you to create squeeze pages. And what a squeeze page is, and sorry I'm not looking at you, I'm watching the road. What a squeeze page is, it is a page that requires forced registration in order to um, view the properties. You know, it says, hey, click here to see all properties in Minneapolis. And they click it and they see the first photo. And then it says to continue to see the photo, create a free account, sign up with your Facebook or sign up with your email address or something like that. Um, so you create a squeeze page, you post it in all of that city's for sale sites. So in Minneapolis, there's a ton of them. I mean, I think there might be a hundred of them, so you just kind of rotate which ones you use. But in some smaller suburbs, like a Roseville or something like that, there might be only eight or nine. So I'll create a Facebook squeeze page. I'll post it to my business site first. And on my business site, um, I actually created a separate business site just for these spammy type posts. Because they are, they're spammy, you gotta get used to it, it is what it is. If you want the leads or not, this is how I do it. It works for me. It might not work for you. No big deal. Um, also, if you're in a very small market, this might not work. So I created something called M MNWI, Minwe, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Homes for Sale. I take that, I post it on my business page, and then I share from my business page, uh, my spam business page, into these garage sale and these for sale sites. Um, I generate between eight and 15,000 leads a year. Um, I've been doing this for going on three years now, and this works really well for us. Now you're thinking, okay, now I have a bad email address, or I don't have a name or a phone number. All I have is their email address. Well, two things. One, if they sign up using their Facebook, you have their Facebook profile. I then go in and add them as a friend. Your Facebook is no longer your Facebook. Your Facebook, if you do the way that I do it, is now a lead generation system. So don't post left, don't post right, don't post religious, don't do this, don't do that. I don't care who you voted for, you don't talk about that. Um, so then I, um, which was hard for me to do. Um, so then I uh, add everybody on Facebook. So then I can invite them to like my real business page. If they only sign up with an email address and it's a it's a real one, not um, some of these interesting ones we see, um, you're like, okay, well now I don't have their name or phone number. Go to whitepages.com, pay $200 for the year, and you get 200 searches a year, uh, a month, excuse me. So you take that email address, you put it into whitepages.com, do the reverse search, you put that email address in there, and then it'll give you a name. Um, and then that name is usually attached to that email address. This is actually very, very accurate. Then you can take that name, you can go into your property records and see if they own any property. Um, so with an email address, we'll get a name, a phone number, and an address if they own any property. So then now we can target them on other platforms as well. So that is in a nutshell what we do. Um, my conversion costs me $1,000 a month. Um, that's because I have the broker level platform for 30 agents. And um, other than that, my Facebook advertising costs me nothing. Um, I'm going to generate $150,000 of GCI gross commission income this year off of my conversion platform. And next year I expect that to double. Um, last year I did 9.5 million in volume. I did 300 some thousand GCI. This year my goal is 23 million and to do just over 640,000 GCI. And I'm on goal to do, on pace to do this. So that is what I do. Now, some people say they do boosts. Sometimes I'll boost, sometimes I will boost a post. Um, but that post is gonna be a, a single property squeeze page that I am trying to promote my own listing for, or a listing that somebody has given me permission to promote. Um, 
I will take that listing. I will still target it in those garage sale sites or for sale sites um, on Facebook, but then I'll also say target, um, share this to my friends and people who like my page and then their friends. Um, one thing, one reason it's really important to get random people to like your Facebook page is because now all of their friends are a targeted metric on Facebook and it's the cheapest target, um, or the, te the cheapest metric to target on Facebook uh, for your money spend. Um, I know that was a lot of information and it might, it might not make sense, but hopefully it does. I tend to ramble a lot, um, but I hope that kind of helps. I don't do... Facebook marketing in the sense that a lot of people think they do it. Um, I don't do I don't do like A/B testing. I don't do that. I truly just spam. Um, it is what it is. I truly spam. I add everybody on Facebook, um, and I uh, am more of a quantity versus quality type guy. Um, it works for us. Um, it might not work for everybody else. So I hope that kind of helps. Um, oh, so I will spend about fifteen to twenty thousand dollars on um, conversion this year because I do, I do do some um, Google AdWords as well, but the majority of it is free by posting into Facebook posts. But I'll spend about twenty thousand on conversion this year, and I'll put you know in between one twenty and one fifty uh, in my pocket. So it's you know what is that uh, eight times Roy? So. Not necessarily 10 times, like I said earlier, so sorry if I over-exaggerated that. Um, okay, that's all I have. I'm going to post this video. If you want to ask me any more questions about this, I will absolutely, sh <clears throat> excuse me, I'll absolutely share. Um, but okay, I have to go into an appointment now. Talk to you later. Once again, William Huffman. I'm with Remax Results out of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Not that that matters. Um, I just say that all the time. Okay, and have a good day. Bye.